everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel if you're new here and like the content please don't forget to subscribe let me give you a little bit of context before i start this video so you guys are not confused on what's happening uh where are the outfit videos up until last month we were renting a one bedroom apartment and now we have moved to a two bedroom apartment because space there was very restricted i only had a living room space to shoot my videos and because now i have this whole setup, my tripod, my camera, the mic, and there are 100 other things that goes into making uh, these videos. So I had to take these big couches out of the living room and put my equipment, shoot the videos, and then take everything out, put the couches back. And there were some days where I was not able to do everything. I was not able to put the couches back. And that was quite frustrating actually uh, for both my husband and I because we were not able to use the living room space. So we thought maybe it's a good investment meant to rent a two bedroom apartment that's what we did and that is what is keeping me busy i'm trying to set up the apartment one space at a time so i thought it's a good idea to take you guys along uh, and show you guys what i got from ikea we visited ikea again last week bought a lot of stuff i'm not really sold on the idea of doing uh, one video for ikea hall uh, but instead we'll divide this apartment into different spaces studio bedroom kitchen living and have a separate video for each of these spaces today's video is for the bedroom let me give you a room tour and uh, show you what it looks like right now so that we can have a before and after comparison let's get started i know this bedroom makeover is going to take more than three hours so let's prepare lunch first because after all that hard work you want to reward yourself with good food and for that i have collaborated with hello fresh and they have sent me fresh ingredients so let's see what we have for lunch today this is what it looks like it comes with your meals and directions on how to prepare them and the best part is you can choose your meal preference i'm a vegetarian so they sent me refried black bean corn pepper taco bowls very tasty and then we have pizza fresh mozzarella and jesty marinara pizza and the third option that we have is creamy mushroom alfredo i am actually craving pasta so i think i'm gonna choose creamy mushroom alfredo nobody really prepares you for the adult life you have to take out time for yourself uh, on top of that you have a full-time job and then you have to clean the house maintain the house uh, cook food go grocery shopping it gets very overwhelming and very hectic uh, it's very difficult to take time out for yourself for your own mental health and this eventually leads to burnout and i am the best example of that i have experienced burnout quite a few times uh, for past few months now and hellofresh can be a valuable tool in helping you make time for yourself with hellofresh you can enjoy convenient meal planning and preparation saving you time and energy on grocery shopping and meal prep. It provides you with delicious pre-portioned ingredients and easy to follow recipes delivered right to your doorstep. By eliminating the need to think about what to cook and gathering the necessary ingredients, HelloFresh allows you to focus on taking that much needed time for yourself. Pasta is ready. Pasta sauce is almost done. It looks so yummy with all these mushrooms and spinach. I know I said I'm making this for lunch, but it looks so tasty that it made me hungry. And now I want to have some of it. Some of it. If you also want to enjoy convenient meals like these, then you can sign up at HelloFresh using my coupon code LIFESTYLECOG to save up to 20 free meals worth up to $195. Now let me finish this very delicious pasta and then we'll start the bedroom makeover. So once you enter the bedroom, this is what it looks like. I'm being very honest here. Uh, it's not great. I have this iron sitting here because I just uh, ironed my shirt this morning. And here we have a standing fan. We use this standing fan at night uh, just for some cross ventilation. Uh, don't really use this uh, AC unit. I really hope that they choose something different uh, in this next building that they are constructing right now because uh, these I hate them. We rarely use it because um, here in Canada there are only a few weeks during summer season where you need AC. We usually keep this fan away uh, in the storage but because we just moved it's just sitting here so I need to keep this away and make some space in the storage. It was very windy last night so this curtain was constantly banging on the window that's why I use this support. And then I have a little cute plant here that has outgrown the pot. So yeah, this is something that I will just keep here. Uh, an empty pot that I need to get out of this room. This is the mess that I have from last night on my nightstand. 
that I have to clean. I was just being lazy and ignored it completely. Uh, this is what the bed looks like. And this is my husband's nightstand. And no, it's not clean because he keeps it clean. It's clean because he just assembled it last night. And we'll take this bottle out. This is something that we got from Ikea. I think this was uh, the most expensive thing. No, my mirror was the most expensive thing, but anyway. And this door here is my husband's closet. This time he gets one full closet just for himself because I have a bigger one in the other room. So yes, this is what the room looks like. I'm making this video just for our reference so that we know what it looked like before and then we can compare it with the after. I'm not really good at doing makeovers but I planned everything beforehand on Canva. I planned this layout so I hope, fingers crossed, that it will look nice at the end even if it's like 80% of what I thought it will be, uh, the end results, then I will be happy because I'm not the best person to go to when it comes to interior designing. And when I was planning everything, I knew one thing for sure, that I don't need any paintings, any uh, frames for this bedroom. I wanted something different so that you get a very different vibe once you enter the bedroom and the whole space changes. That's when I saw this uh, very unique wall hanging. I really like the design. It's very neutral. I think this will give a very boho vibe to this whole bedroom. If it doesn't work out, maybe I can use it in the living room. We'll see. Also bought this toolkit that I'm going to use uh, again from IKEA. But for the life of me, I cannot find the screws. I really hope I do. Otherwise, oh, found them. They were in the toolbox. Let's talk about bedding next. I don't know if you can tell, but olive, sage green, any shade of green is my favorite these days. And that's the reason why I bought this queen set that has one duvet cover and two pillow covers in a very light olive green shade. Uh, it has like gray stripes on it. I'll show you a zoomed in version on the side maybe. So this is the first thing. Second, I really needed that modern boho, but a hotel vibe in this bedroom. At the same time, I was like so confused. My husband and I have a little fight over this i don't know how practical it is but i got white bed sheet with two white pillow covers uh, he's always like functionality over form and i am like form over functionality i need that aesthetic uh vibe aesthetic look everywhere uh, and he thinks that it's not practical all the time even though I agree he's not wrong. But for now, we'll use these sheets. And uh, you guys tell me in the comment section if you have a white bed sheet set and how do you maintain it? Because I need tips. Next is this duvet. Uh, we really needed one for summer season. Uh, right now, the one that we have is for winters. And that's the reason why we need this standing fan all the time. So we got this one uh, with a low level of uh, warmness. So there are a few levels. Uh, the first one is like very, very hot where it shows the temperature up until the top. And then second one is less warm. Uh, this is like the third level and the last level is like the cooler one. So you have red, orange, yellow, and blue. Uh, we got yellow. This is white in color, but then uh, I have uh, this duvet cover in a light green shade that will go on top of this. So it's all good. Next, I got this pillow for myself because mine was uh, very old, so I needed to replace that. That's everything. I forgot to mention a tiny detail that we have two mattresses, not one. So we have this box spring and then on top of that we have uh, mattress number one. I'm sorry, I'm out of breath. And then uh, on the very top we have uh, this mattress number two. Don't ask me why, uh, it's a long story for some other time. Why can't we Never was.
This bed sheet completely changed how this room looks. It's so much brighter and it feels so spacious, uh, very cozy. Now let me show you what all I have here in terms of decor. Uh, my husband really wanted a clock in the bedroom. Uh, so I'm thinking maybe on that little wall there, I can put this up. From Tulip Farms, uh, I got this pot. It was a set of four. Uh, the previous one that you saw, it came as a set. I'm thinking maybe I can use it for one of the nightstands. We'll see. And then I also got this lid from Ikea, just the lid, not the container. I'm thinking something like this will look really nice and then i got this set of three that you can put it on the table i'm not really sure if i'm going to use them in this room next is this vase i really like uh, the shape i saw some people buying uh, palm leaves i thought it will look very nice when i put it in this vase i didn't bring any plants or anything from ikea because i already had these artificial plants lying around the house so i took two leaves out of this and now i'll just put it in the vase like so like this and it looks very nice we thrifted this lamp uh, like a year ago uh, it's quite old i don't know if uh, the original owner bought it from ikea or not and i know you guys might be thinking that one nightstand is brown the other one is white what's happening why is there a mismatch that's because i really don't want to spend a lot of money uh the brown nightstand we thrifted that it's second hand we tried to save money wherever possible but this time we couldn't find anything good on facebook marketplace that's when we decided to buy this one but i don't think it's a big deal once I have all this stuff uh, on these nightstands, it will all come together. Hopefully, fingers crossed. Let's do it. I've been feeling so small. Watch the clock ticking off the wall. But tonight, I let it go. Spend my coin for sure. I'm gonna be myself, or I could be someone else. Finally, it's all done. I'm super tired and I'm hungry again. Uh, but I quickly want to wrap up this video. I did the cleaning. It took me three, three and a half hours. But don't look at the clock. Uh, time there is still 10.10 10 because I couldn't find the batteries. Uh, and I did a really bad job at hanging it. Maybe once my husband is back from work, we'll try and fix it. But anyway, I'm super happy the way it turned out. I think it's time for me to eat that pasta again but if you also want to save up to 20 free meals worth up to 195 dollars then you can use my code lifestylecog at hellofresh really hope that you guys enjoyed today's video and if you did please don't forget to like share and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next one bye